Good morning, it's your friendly neighborhood coach, Dr. Wu. Oh, I can see my breath this morning. Ah, the sun has already risen. Ah, thought of the day. When I change the way I look at things, the things I look at actually change. Mmm, pondering. Pretty amazing fact, huh? That our perspective, that the stories we tell ourselves or the meaning that we assign to a certain person, event or occurrence or thing, really determines how it will affect us and how it will be written into our story. So the action step is, hmm, look at that bird flying by. Action step is what? In what area would I like to actually be curious and compassionate about and reconsider and consider how I might want to change the way I'm looking at it? Is there a possibility another way of looking at it? This requires quite a bit of courage and faith and humility as I'm trying to also practice this truth and uh, in my case I always want to and what I find most helpful and true to me is to actually look at things either people events or things from the perspective of the glasses of God's scriptures and that really really um, creates a life that really does follow the Lord so yeah one of the things you might want to say is quote you can say to yourself the story I am telling myself and you fill in the blank so let's say something happens and you say hmm I'm gonna be curious and compassionate what am I thinking what am I feeling what are my attitudes the story I am telling myself is and then just to actually journal it if you have time and then see how it lines up with uh, what our amazing Abba Daddy says about us and about people about situations about life itself so that's what I'll be working on ah, the story I am telling myself about this is and see how it lines up have an amazing, blessed day, everyone. Shalom, peace. Remember, practice good, deep, conscious breaths. Practice grounding with your five senses. Stay fully present. Be curious and compassionate with yourself. Have an amazing day full of love and healing and health and grace and truth and forgiveness and compassion to yourself and to others. Be blessed everyone. Shalom, peace. Shalom is wholeness. That means you're whole in mind, body, and spirit. Everything mended, all the broken pieces put together with God's golden love and healing and wholeness. Shalom, peace. In the great physician's name, Yahweh, Rafa, and in the Lord that provides all that we need for life and for godliness. Jehovah Jireh. Banner over me is love. Be blessed, everyone. Blessings, everyone. <laughs>